Hi again, boys and girls. I do have a read aloud for you today. I got a new book donated to our classroom. This is a book called Be You, and it's another one by that author, Peter Reynolds. We have read several of his books. I did a read aloud from one of his books um, called Sky Color um, earlier in this series of YouTube videos. This one was just donated to us and it's called Be You, and the author is Peter H. Reynolds. I look at the cover and it just gives me such hope. Look at how happy he is sailing away on his boat with balloons. All right, here is Be You by Peter H. Reynolds. Here's our cover page. You were born to be so many things. If you ever get the chance to look closely, you can see all the characteristics that they mean in the bubbles around the words. Some of them that I'm reading are generous, hopeful, patient, optimistic, which means seeing the bright side of things. My wish for you, no matter where your journey leads, is for you to always be you. His shirt says, born to be me. That's right. Be ready to take that next step toward being an amazing human being. Be curious, turn every stone, ask every why, and keep digging deeply to discover your own answers. Be adventurous, live a big life. When you are ready, step outside your comfort zone, bravely explore new paths and see where they lead you. She was really proud to be on top of that hill there, being adventurous. I like the colors in that picture. It says, be connected, find kindred spirits, be with those who make you feel like the real you. And we have two good friends here on a bike. Be persistent, keep going. Never stop, keep going, never stop, keep going, never stop. Be persistent. That means keep following your dreams no matter if you have tough times. It says be different. Be silly, be quirky, be odd, be unique, be weird, be colorful, be okay with being different. Be just the way you are. Be kind, be understanding. Help those around you to be themselves. Listen, then listen some more. Learn more about who they are. Boys and girls, this is a great time for you to learn more about who the people in your own family are. Be brave, try new things. Take a deep breath and plunge forward into new experiences. It gets easier every time you try. I can speak to that because it's getting a little easier for me to talk to you in this way. This was a hard thing for me to do, but every time you try something new, um, the more often that you try it, the easier it will get. It says, be your own thinker. Think for yourself and set your own unique course. It isn't always easy, but you'll be heading in the direction of you. So in this illustration, there's a group of people headed in one direction, and then this friend is heading off on a different path. And that's okay. Be okay being alone. Take time to be on your own. Hear your own thoughts, your inner voice. Listen to your heart. That 
that's something that we try to do every day when we're together is take a little moment to be mindful of where we are and listen to ourselves. Be patient. Being more you takes time. Take a deep breath. Relax. Let your future unfold at its own pace. It will be worth the wait. Absolutely. Be okay reaching out for help. When you need a helping hand, a compassionate ear, an encouraging word, reach out. It is okay to ask for help and it is a good thing. As you voyage out into the world, remember, and a voyage is kind of a journey that someone will go on. So as you voyage out into the world, remember, no matter what, you will always be loved. Yes, you will always be loved, boys and girls. You are ready, so go ahead and be you. Be very, very you. All right, that was Be You by Peter H. Reynolds. What a nice message to leave you with today. To be yourself, to find your own path, to do what makes you happy and what makes you feel good, um, and to share your talents with the world because you all have special talents to share. All right, boys and girls, I'm thinking of you, I miss you, and I will see you soon.